we are going to start new chapter graphical representation in this chapter we will study about histogram and ogive a histogram is a two dimensional graphical representation of continuous frequency distribution important points we have to keep it in our mind first one class interval should be in the continuous grouped data form for graph scale is must along x axis class interval should be taken and along y axis frequencies should be taken then construct rectangles with class interval as base and corresponding frequency as height you will get the histogram the given question is class interval 10 to 16 16 to 22 22 to 28 28 to 34 34 to 40 and the frequency is 15 23 30 20 16 okay the class interval is in the form of continuous okay so very simple what we have to do it first you have to take the graph sheet write the scale in x axis 2 centimeter is equal to 6 units and y axis 2 centimeter is equal to 5 units ok then draw the x axis and y axis ok along the x you have to take class interval along the y axis we have to take frequency ok then 0 10 16 22 28 34 40 and here 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 like this okay and then you have to see 10 to 16 16 to 22 the size is 6 and here 10 0 to 10 10 so you have to break because this part is not equal to this okay break it construct rectangles with class intervals as bases and corresponding frequencies as heights you will get the required histogram Class interval 30 to 39, 40 to 49, 50 to 59, 60 to 69, 70 to 79. Okay. Frequencies 24, 16, 10, 18, 20. In this question, class interval is not in continuous form okay so we have to take adjustment factor first one upper limit of the first one 
and the lower limit of the second one we have to take it okay upper limit of the first thirty nine and the lower limit of the second class interval forty we have to take and then get the difference difference between forty and thirty nine okay difference between forty and thirty nine so forty minus thirty nine is equal to one okay second step divide the difference by 2 that is equal to 1 upon 1 divided by 2 you will get 0 0.5 so adjustment factor is 0 0.5 okay now you have to get actual lower limit 30 minus 0 0.5 you will get 29.5 40 minus 0 0.5 39.5 50 minus 0 0.5 49.5 60 minus 0 0.5 59.5 70 minus 0 0.5 69.5 okay same way actual upper limit thirty nine plus 0 0.5 so lower limit we have to do the subtraction and with the upper limit we have to add so 79.5 okay actual class interval and frequency to 29.5 to 39.5 39.5 to 49.5 49.5 to 59.5 59.5 to 69.5 69.5 to 79.5 and the frequency is 24 16 10 18 and 20 so we have to draw the histogram for this actual class interval and the frequencies scale in x axis 2 cm is equal to 10 units and y axis 
2 cm is equal to 4 units. The scale you can take as you like. Okay, it is not compulsory that what I have taken, same you have to take. Okay, so you can take 5 also, 2 also, okay. And class interval, actual class interval along the x axis. x and y, 0. Here, actual class interval and here frequency then 0 10 and here 4 8, 12, 16 and keep going on. Okay. And you will get the histogram. Last mark, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64. Frequencies, 8, 12, 15, 18, 25, 19, 10. And you should know what is class mark. Upper limit. Plus lower limit divided by 2. Okay, that is the class mark. Now we got 16, the answer of this. So what you have to do is, first one, get the difference between the first two. Find difference between... 24 and 16. You will get 24 minus 16 is equal to 8. Okay. Second, divide 8 by 2. Okay. 8 by 2. So you will get 4. Clear? Now, upper limit sixteen plus four, you will get twenty. Twenty-four plus four, you will get twenty-eight. Thirty-two plus four, you will get thirty-six. Forty plus four. 44, 48 plus 4, 52, 56 plus 4, 60, 64 plus 4, you will get 68. Then lower limit, 16 minus 4, you will get 12. Then 24 minus 4, you will get 20. 32 minus 4, you will get 28. 40 minus 4, 36. 48 minus 4, 44. 56 minus 4, 52. 64 minus 4, 60. Okay. Class interval and then frequency. 12 to 
twenty, twenty two, twenty eight, twenty eight to thirty six, thirty six to forty four, forty four to fifty two, fifty two to sixty, sixty to sixty eight, frequency eight. Twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-five, nineteen, and ten. Okay. Take the graph. Write the scale. 